So I've got a flashy iPhone and I've got this cool keyboard. This is one of the Apple keyboards and it's a Bluetooth keyboard. And that's the trick right there is you need to have yourself a Bluetooth keyboard to be able to get that keyboard connected to your phone. How are you? My name is Emilio. I work in tech and I love it. And a new phone, an old phone, whatever the phone is, as long as you've got an iPhone that has Bluetooth, you can actually get a keyboard like this or a different Bluetooth keyboard actually working on your phone. You've got messages, you've got WhatsApp, you've got all of these cool applications. You can go and surf the internet and type in www.emilioaguero.net and search something on the interwebs via a keyboard that is connected to Bluetooth. Hey, and also I release videos all the time and a lot of you watch my videos and that is excellent, but a lot of you are not subscribed. So why don't you go and click on that button and on the bell, click on those notifications, turn them on so that you don't miss out on any of my video releases. What we're gonna do is, one, you need to have your keyboard ready. You need to have your keyboard in pairing mode, the same way that you would have connected that keyboard to a computer. Every keyboard will be different. Some keyboards on the back, on the front, there may be a button that says connect or pair or something like that. Essentially making your keyboard discoverable on the Bluetooth network. You then go and pick up your iPhone, go into the settings area, then you scroll down to the third option down under Wi-Fi. It says Bluetooth right there, making sure that your Bluetooth is turned on. You're gonna to need to find that keyboard, which is now discoverable across the Bluetooth network. It should be listed under the other devices area down the very, very bottom. If it's not listed in there, it means that your keyboard is not in discoverable mode. Now, once that keyboard has been found, all you do is you simply click on it and then it will connect. You can now open up your notes, you can open up your messages, you can open up your web browser on your iPhone and start using your keyboard. So why don't you let me know whether this worked or whether if it didn't work for you in the comments below. But that's it, thanks so much for spending the time. Do what you do in the YouTube social medias by liking and also subscribe to my channel by clicking on that button below so that you don't miss out on anything. Thanks again, we'll talk to you next time.